Welcome to Pop Turnative, where we dive into topical discussions from the worlds of pop culture, social media, and sports. Here is your host, Peter Romoliotis, aka PD Beats. PD Beats here from Pop Turnative. Speaking of Stefan Manas, about Ted Lasso season two is going to be dropping July twenty third on Apple TV Plus. Welcome to the show, man. Thank you for doing this. Hi everyone, thank you, Peter. Very happy to be here. Thanks for inviting me, guys. No, it's it's great to chat with you. Before we get into Ted Lasso, for you, for acting and storytelling, when did you decide that acting was something you wanted to do, Stefan? Um, okay, uh, when did I decide? I got a really crush. Uh, my first crush on the uh, movies was uh, when I was 11 with uh, Harry Potter. I, I had the same age as the, as the character. Sorry, I'm... I'm... I'm kicking my camera. <laughs> so I had the same age as the Daniel Radcliffe in the Harry Potter one, and I found this so amazing. And I come from a very little town, so so for us in the family and for me to, it's, it's like a different world. It's like yeah. Cosmo Ali and all the actors are doing stuff great. But I really loved the uh, movie at this time. Then when I was 16, uh, they were shooting actually a movie in my own town, and they were requesting from uh, extras, uh, background uh, workers. So. I applied and uh, I went in the in the shooting for just a normal shooting, a normal uh, movie and uh, for, for a week. And I really enjoyed the the ambience, the atmosphere, even still just doing nothing, obviously. But uh, how they were preparing, acting, um, everything here, the hundreds of people working on this. And uh, yeah, so I've decided when I was 16 that that could be an option. But I still had to pursue studies, so so I've done actually a, a master in, in marketing, and uh, just nice. after this, I, I went to uh, I went to acting when I finished my study. Awesome! I have a master's in communications, so oh, yeah. pretty, pretty similar. <laughs> um, you're on Ted Lasso, which is one of the biggest shows in the world right now. I'm just curious for you specifically. Um, what was your kind of knowledge or interest with football before? joining Ted Lasso? Did you play? Did you watch it? Was there interest? Oh, okay. I don't play much. Um, okay. I've never played much before. I'm more a handball player. You know handball? Yeah, yeah of course. Okay, so I, I've played this a lot. And uh, as watching, I enjoyed more rugby. Till uh, 2010 uh, with Lyon, and I really discovered Lyon football, Juninho, the free kicks. Uh, in, I, yeah, I come from a very small hometown, so we are three thousand, four thousand people. So n- not a team to cheer, stuff like this. And after graduation, I went to big cities, and I said, okay, football is a thing. Uh, yeah, I was in love with Juninho. It was quite amazing to see uh, this free kicker, and now PSG. But uh, I wasn't much a football fan before. But with 2018, Ted Lasso, obviously, uh, <laughs> I, I went to London and uh, I, I was with people who had a real passion and connection with football. So I didn't grow with it from a young age. I will never have this um, connection with football as English people. But now I, I'm really fun of it, thanks to our team. Uh, the French team, 2018, was quite amazing. And um, I like PSG too. Well, it's... it's uh, strange team still it's a little different but i was a liverpool fan yep. like a lot of friends uh arsenal of course Thierry Henry is, a, is a huge star for us so i'm into football but not a, a lot 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 but you're into football a little bit more now because of ted lasso right a lot more now <laughs> uh, be, of course i spend my days uh, kicking balls and uh with the other actors uh they're all very good and uh, i think they, they make a little fun of me because i was the least good uh, i'm still of course <laughs> and uh but still I, I played a lot with them and uh, spent time i think i'm much better now and uh, it's it's such a fun game uh it's, it's quite yeah, we have we have a lot of good time uh, playing football, and uh, we we are always very careful not to get injured. For actors, it's very important. So we play it kind of gentle, and uh, we have fun whenever we have time. We kick uh, some free kicks, and uh, yeah, no, I, I really like it. Obviously, so people loved season one of Ted Lasso. They're going to be able to see season two very yeah. soon, July twenty third, first episode. Then it's going to be week after week on Apple TV Plus. Has it hit you? that this is a show that has fans that watch it all over the world. It is, it's pretty amazing to see that the fan base of Ted Lasso is global, right, Stefan? It's amazing. Well, it's great. Uh, first of all, 
extremely happy to be part of a show that is working. It's our goal as actors. Um, we need to have a response from the from the, the spectators. How do you say that? From the from fans, yep. from the people, from the viewers, from the, yeah, yeah, from the viewers, and uh, they're extremely happy. So that's the first check, and that's great. Uh, personally, I don't. I'm not going to say I don't care, but but it's it's. I was quite. Pre- it's part of the job, and we did this, and we're super happy. I'm not going to change, and I think all the people uh, from Jason to uh, um, low actors like me, we. We're very happy, but we still have work to do. We stay focused. We stay in shape. Uh, we all work hard uh, for the next seasons coming, and uh, it's super happy. I don't receive a t- ton of message, but still, people they notice me a little here, a little there. They ch- search my name, write me on Instagram or uh, somewhere, and say, "Hey, we love your 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 little part in Ted Lasso from Mexico, from uh, uh, South Africa, wherever." So it uh, makes me quite happy. It always make my day. So so we're very happy about this. It's really exciting, and you know, people that have watched Ted Lasso, you know, season one, little bit bittersweet kind of moments. Uh, Richmond has been relegated, so um, we're not going to go into big spoilers or anything. But you know, we're going to expect a interesting different motive like motivated richmond for season two who are going to be in a whole different world stefan it's a whole different world it's a whole different league it's going to be interesting to see how they adapt yeah so uh without any spoilers um like people can expect we just this the team is still trying to adapt to the lasso way so we're getting much closer with a coach uh understand what he was trying to do in the first season failed but still we, we get this connection and uh, the team is trying to to follow his lead uh rebecca is uh is uh switch with the lasso way uh we are getting uh fun of him and there is of course a lot of personal problem that getting uh, in our way and uh we're still fighting in this new environment which is not our place so we're trying to find uh the solution because we don't we know we don't belong here yeah and um, and hey, we we get we bond to each other, still fighting, working hard. Uh, lots of personal issues in this uh, second season, and I think it's still gonna be very good, very funny. And uh, we try to find a way to get back in the Premier League, and uh, we'll see if it happens. I talked to a lot of your friends that you work on with the show. You know, Tohib, Mo, uh, Christo. They all enjoy the locker room scenes. Like, there's a lot of scenes you guys film. But they really like doing the locker room scenes. That's, why do you think? Our, yeah, why? <laughs> yeah, exactly. The, what, what do you enjoy so much about doing the locker room scenes? This locker room, like it's when everyone is here. So yeah. sometimes we have seen on the pitch. There's just Toy. There's just uh, um, oh, I have the, the wrong name. Just Phil. Uh, just Cola. Or sometimes just me. Or there's yeah. okay. The locker room. Everyone's here. Okay. So it's time when we see each, all each other. We get in. We get here on time. Always professional. We have a little time. We talk about all this, that, family stuff, video games, football, whatever. And it's time when we are all together as a family, as personal. And uh, we we always love the time in the locker room. And uh, it's always a very funny scene. And most of the time, Jason is here to make a speech, uh, to solve some issues or funny things because we're all together and the writers are really trying to to express uh, this locker room because it's just a locker room in the end. Uh, the colors are, are nice and uh, people are positioned in, in very specific way. And uh, they make a lot of it in this small pace, place, small area with lots of character. We are 20 people in this. Cameraman does this, this and that and that. There may be 40 people in that. And in the end of the screen, it has to look extremely warm. But it's easy for us. It's our place. It's, uh, it's like our home. So, so we always have time in, in the locker room. Oh, for sure. And th- some of the best scenes, in my opinion, are the locker room scenes. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Which is awesome. Which okay. Which one is your favorite in the, in the first season? In the first season... Uh, obviously, when you're going over the plan, the new, the new, the new, um, the new plans, right? The new, uh, the, the the new, yeah, the, yeah, the different, the different plays, the different plays. Remember, you were going all the different plays. You're talking. Everyone's like, like saying a different play. 
Like oh, Vassal's yeah, yeah, special, yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. It's just next to the locker room. Uh, they, oh, uh, that's the not, okay. My favorite oh. locker room scene, obviously, well, like everyone, is the practice scene. The practice. We talk about practice. <laughs> but no, that's okay. not my favorite. That's not my okay. favorite. That's not my favorite part, though. My favorite part is after when he's like set up the cones. <laughs> yeah. Okay. And then call uh, yeah, Billy good. and call uh, Cola are like. You're supposed to, you're reserved. You go and do the cover. That is one of my favorite scenes with um, Christo and um, Phil when yep. they're kicking the ball uh, to the cross. I love this one. Yeah. Again, that's not a lot. That's also not a locker room scene, though. We just oh, named. <laughs> um, this, this show is about a football team, but it's obviously more, it's, it's about way more than just football. It's about these players, the growth, and the relationships. Did you notice that? when you were reading the script for the show, that this was not just about football, it was way more about football, Stefan? Um, personally, I was hoping a lot more football uh, when I just read, the, um, not the entire script, but the, the synopsis, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, there's this American football coach who's gonna come to England to coach soccer. Okay, very funny. Uh, we need to see football because I was thinking, it's gonna shoot in, in London, Premier League, uh, the potential, potentials, sorry for my English, uh, yeah. the fan potentials, they want to see football, they want action and stuff like this. There is still, there, there is, and there, there, are, there are scenes like this and people love it, but uh, it's so personal and that's why it's, it, Ted Lasso is working. It can be for little girl, old guy, I don't, I hate football. You yeah. can love the, you you love the show anyway. Uh, there is many friend of my girls, old, young, whatever. Uh, not football fan. People watch football. The show is great. It's not just about football. If it no. was, maybe it would have been different uh, uh, with the reviews. So yeah, they find um, the writers, Jason, all this, the, the, all the people who work on this uh, construction. They had a very good idea. It's not just about football. And just give it a go. And people, all the people who don't like football, I'm not going to watch it. I don't like football. There is no point. Okay, switch yourself. And everyone, okay, just two episodes, just to see. And here we go. And everyone loves it. Absolutely. Thank you so much for coming on the show. I really appreciate it. No, thank you. Thank you. It was a pleasure. And, and je vais améliorer mon français. On va faire une entrevue en français. <laughs> <laughs> next time <I'm>, next <laughs> time <we'll... laughs> so uh yeah so they can watch ted lasso season one now on apple tv yeah. plus but july 23rd it's exciting because the new episodes of season two are going to be coming out week after week which is awesome and um we're going to follow you on social media to keep up to date with everything um, I'm not such a, I don't share that much, but uh, on Instagram, I have my Instagram, Stefan Manas, all attached. And this is where I share some stories when I go here, when I go there, yeah. when I'm with the boys of Ted Lasso, or when I share stuff about the show. So mainly, and the only things, uh, I'm on Twitter too, but I use more Instagram. Amazing. Absolutely. This has been Pop Turnative, youtube.com slash Pop Turn for previous episodes. Be sure to catch Stefan Manis and the rest of the amazing cast and crew for season two of Ted Lasso, July 23rd on Apple TV+. Plus. Until next time, this is Stefan and PD Beats signing off. Thank you for tuning in to Pop Turnative. Make sure to check out our past episodes of Pop Turnative on YouTube. Be sure to like Pop Turnative on Facebook and follow us on Twitter. This has been an Autograph Communications production.